Hello, welcome to my Jacob's Doctor Who Series 9, Episode 10, um, Face the Raven review of the Jacob's Review Show. Hope you guys enjoy. Okay, um, Face the Raven. I loved Face the Raven. It was a great um, send-off for Clara. Um, General is Coleman. Um... I've got to say, Jenna Coleman will be missed out of Doctor Who, um, and all that stuff. But the thing I loved about this episode was how um, basically Rigsy called Clara in the TARDIS. And basically, the Doctor and Clara went to Riggsy's house, and basically, Riggsy had a baby, had a baby girl. In his house, and he didn't know where she came from and stuff. And then he's like, and then basically, um, he has like this tattoo thing on his neck, at the back of his neck. And it kind of reminded me of the uh, this movie called In Time. How like it was count, it, how the numbers always counted down, and then they had to get money and stuff um, to top the thing to top the numbers back up and everything. So it kind of reminded me of that um, movie, by the way, um, which was really cool. Um, and it was like, will Riggsy die or not, or whatever. And um, I loved how basically you end up seeing um, the Doctor and Clara doing those counting things. The Doctor was like, make sure you count when you walk or, and try and look for this certain thing that they're looking for. Um, which is really cool. I loved how they ended up spotting the alleyway, um, the secret alleyway type thing. Um, where all the Doctor's enemies were and everything, but in this whole alleyway street corner type thing, because the shield, because our shielder is looking after all the enemies and she's like in charge of all the doctor's enemies and everything which is really cool um, I love how she comes back and she was the one that put the tattoo on Riggsy I love how they mentioned Redcon, they mentioned Redcon in Torchwood Um, so I love the mention of um, Redcon because that was mentioned in Torchwood, as I said. Um, so I love the mention of Redcon again. Um, I've got to say I loved um, how basically um, a shielder said she would look like protect Clara, um, make sure Cl Clara is protected and stuff. Um, and basically, I love how Clara was like, you can be good cop, I can be bad cop. And the doctor was like, why, why, why do I have to be good cop? Why can't you be, why can't you be good cop and I be bad cop? I love the hell that the doctor was like that. Um, I love how basically, um, you ended up getting to see, um, all, like, some of the doctor's, uh, enemies, like the Jadoon. Um, as I said before, like all the Doctor's enemies are there, and you see like a Cyberman and an Ood, which is awesome. Um, because we haven't seen like the Dadoon and that in like for like 
ages, and I love seeing the Dragoon in this episode again, like we saw in the first part of Series 9, how we saw the Shadow Proclamation, which was really cool. Um, and I love this ep I also love this episode um, because, like, how Clara gets the tattoo, like, touches the tattoo and removes the tattoo from Riggsy and it goes on to her, basically. That's that was really cool how Clara like was being kind of like the Doctor in a way how the, the Doctor would have done probably the same thing for Riggsy possibly I don't know um, but she was kind of being a good friend to Riggsy because he, she was like no you have family um, and I want you to be safe Riggsy basically um, which is really cool of Clara to do that for Riggsy. Um, also, I love how basically um, the man that uh, got killed by that raven bird, um, that was really um, sad to see, but um, it was really cool, like a cool moment to see also, like how like the raven was after that old man who stole food um, for his family and stuff, so that was really cool to see. Um, I love how basically the shielder was like, can you in like, can you investigate, um, and try and lo look for basically the killer if the killer is it, who whoever the ki killer is. But basically, as I said, with Clara uh, taking the the tattoo off Riggsy, basically, it kind of backfired kind of at the very end because um, the uh, the Ashilda was about to basically take the tattoo off Riggsy and then basically Riggsy looked at um, Clara and was like I don't have the tattoo anymore Clara does and it was like whoa what's going to happen now, is Clara going to survive, or isn't she? And basically, I love how basically Clara um, says, Doctor, it's time for me to go, and like says goodbye to the Doctor and stuff. And basically sacrifices herself for Riggsy, and tells the doctor to don't worry and always be the same man the doctor is like a good person who saves people um, which I love about Clara because Clara um, helped the doctor in a way because wanting to protect the doctor um, and also her friend Riggsy um, which I love about General is common Clara um, amazing actress um, I love that lady in the, uh, cage. How she was, like, still alive and everything. Um, and that, like, kind of trans, um, lady. Um, she was okay, um, and yeah, so basically I rated this um, episode a perfect solid 10 out of 10. I loved Face the Raven episode. It was sad to see General Liz Coleman, Clara leave. Um, as Clara, but um, who knows what's going to happen in next week's episode. Um, so, see you guys for the next week's episode review of the Jacobs Review Show of Episode 11, Season 9, and then the hour-long finale the week after. So, see you guys then, and hope you guys enjoyed my review. So, please like, subscribe, and comment down below your thoughts. Thank you.